I graduated um, the geomatics program in 2004. I had a great experience here. A uh, small class size, you knew your professor, you could chat with your professors in the halls. It was a very tight group. I still keep in touch with everyone I graduated with. I graduated from UNB in 1979 in what was then called surveying engineering. Uh, I've continued my affiliation over the years with the faculty and uh, Dave Coleman is an old friend of mine and I've continued to maintain a business and personal friendship over many, many years. My experience as a GGE student has been very challenging, except very rewarding. Being part of the smaller class sizes has enabled me to be part of a close-knit group of students, and this has given me a better appreciation and understanding of the field of geodesy and geomatics engineering. Uh, coming in as a transfer student from a technical school, I felt very welcome in the department, and I was, didn't take any time at all to become settled in my classes. It really has no boundaries. A uh, geomatic student is hard to come by. There's only two schools in Canada we can recruit from for this. So they're sought after, and they're sought after hard. They can step out of the school and they can get a job. For somebody in geodesy and geomatics engineering to get a summer job in this field, it's pretty easy. Typically, you'll see employers coming every year uh, from offshore surveying companies to land surveying companies out west, and typically there's more job opportunities available than there are students within this department. Uh, the prospects are excellent. Uh... The students can get jobs in a wide range of industries. Uh, natural resources, of course, are booming right now in Canada, and that's always been a really big market for geomatics engineers. There is no wait for jobs. If you're the right person and have the right attitude, you will not have to wait for a job. In fact, you will have numerous companies vying for your attention at this point in the game.